In this section, we'll review how to get to your WordPress site from your Joomla dashboard. WordPress is a component in Joomla, so go to your Components menu. Once you enter the WordPress dashboard, and in some cases you may have to log in again if it asks you for a login, use the same credentials that you use to log into Joomla. Once you enter the WordPress dashboard, uh, you will see that there is a My Sites button at the top of the page. This is because you are using a WordPress multi-site installation which allows you to have multiple blogs. In the main dashboard, you will have controls that affect all of your WordPress blogs. But most of the time, you'll be working within one blog or another. To access your blogs, go to My Sites, Network Admin, and Sites. Now that we've entered through My Sites Network Admin Sites, you'll see that we have five blogs listed. One of them is a root blog, and then four of them are basically subdirectories of the root blog called Business Valuation, CPA to CPA, etc. If we go into the live site, you will see that this corresponds with the menu items. We have a root blog at the menu, and then we have sub menu items for the individual blogs. In this particular case, the root blog is one that won't be used very often. As you can see here, it simply is a guide to the readers to select the blog that best suits their interest. So I wouldn't anticipate in this particular construction that this root blog would be used very often. When you wish to do a blog entry, go to the blog that you're working on and select Dashboard. Most of the time, you'll be entering your blog dashboard to submit a new blog entry. You can do that either through entering the Posts menu and then selecting Add New from there, or you can add new from the submenu that appears to the right. We'll go through the Posts menu. Now you can see all of your previous posts for this particular blog, and there's an Add New button at the top. When you add your new post, you'll enter the title here, the body of the blog post here. You will select your categories in this section. If you wish to add a new category, you can add it from here. And then choose the Add New Category button. And for your tags, you can simply add, enter one tag at a time. These are searchable concepts that people can use to find blog content. Or, once you have a lot of tags in your blog, you can say choose from the most used tags and choose the tags from here. And that's all it takes to get started entering your new blog. Do make sure that you always add categories and tags because that improves the searchability of your WordPress site and it also improves the SEO status. You have several options for publishing your new blog post. You can save a draft at any time and come back to work on it later. You can look at previews of the blog post as you draft it. You can publish it immediately when it's time to publish, or you can publish at a future date and time by selecting the Edit button next to the Publish Immediately verbiage. Once you hit the Publish button, your blog post will be live. After completing your blog post, if you wish to enter a post in another blog, simply return to the My Sites button at the top of your dashboard, go to Network Admin and Sites, and you can enter the dashboard of another blog from here. And that's it! With these simple instructions, you are now ready to blog using your WordPress for Joomla multi-site blog.